the real. Hello and welcome to the new video. If you want to install Windows 10, you usually need a bootable USB drive or Windows CD. Since CD drives are less and less in use and a lot of devices doesn't even have CD drives, you will need to create a bootable USB flash drive with Windows 10 ISO image on it. Also, there are other ways to do it, but uh, we will not cover that in this video. So, on Windows 10, there are at least two methods to create a USB bootable media. You can either use Microsoft Media Creation Tool that we are using today, or third-party tool like, for example, Rufus. To create bootable USB with support for both firmware types, UEFI and legacy BIOS. What is UEFI and what is legacy BIOS will be explained in some of the future videos. We will not need that for now. But for you to know, majority of devices, of course, we talk about devices that needs OS, uses UEFI as default. In today's video, I will teach you how to create bootable USB flash drive using Microsoft Media Creation Tool and in the next one how to do it with a third-party software. So just follow these simple steps. It is around 10 or 12 clicks. Okay, let's go. First, what we need? We need Google. So in Google type download media creation tool and enter first result is what we need click on that and you will get this window next thing that you need after downloading so let's first download click on that choose where you want to save it we're going to choose desktop save and media creation tool is in the bottom left corner and on your desktop surface. So next thing we need is USB device, uh, at least eight gigabytes. So plug it in. And run media creation tool. It will be prompted. Just click yes. And this is very easy process. Uh, the thing that is most boring in this part is you just need to wait for this to happen. But be patient and uh, follow steps, nothing else. We will skip this part where it is just loading. First, applicable notice and license terms. You can read it. You don't have to, whatever you want. On this window, click accept. Now, again, get a few things ready. Okay, now, in this window, what do we want to do? We want to create installation media, USB flash drive, DVD or ISO file or ISO file for another PC. Click next. Now you can use the recommended options for this PC or you can choose something from language, edition and architecture. So Windows 10, 64 bit, English, US and click next. Now choose which media to use. If you want to install Windows 10 on another partition you need to create and then run the media to install it. So we need USB flash drive, as I said, so it needs to be at least 8 GB. So, USB flash drive, next. Uh, this is our F drive that we put in our PC. Click on it and click next. Now again, getting few things ready. And uh, I will fast forward this because it needs to download and then to write it on USB device, so. So 
So with a speed that my ISP provider gave me, uh, it took around 20 minutes to download ISO image. Now verifying and now creating Windows 10 media. So wait for that and you're good to go. We will skip this part. Okay, and we are at 98% uh, of the progress. And it took around, uh, say, 10 minutes to create bootable USB flash drive. 99 and 100. Not yet. Okay. Yeah, it's good. And it says your USB flash drive is ready. So next thing that you want to click is finish. Okay, it is cleaning up process. Leave it. It is just you saw a few seconds. So now when you open your file explorer, you will see F drive. And when you click on it, you will find all necessary files for you to install Windows 10. Uh, and yeah, that's it for today's video. Uh, if you want to learn how to install Windows 10, we will cover that in one of the future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like, share it with your friends, share it on the internet, subscribe on the channel. And if you want to donate, you have a link down there in the description. Feel free to leave me some money. Okay, that's it, guys. Again, goodbye and see ya.